We know what you're thinking, Easter fun is just for kids. Well, no it isn't. We're going to share some unique ways that you can impress your date and share some wonderful, magical Easter themed experiences. Easter egg hunt date night. I've always wanted to do an Easter egg hunt because I think it seems really fun. I just love the treasure trail, solving riddles maybe, and then opening up your egg and seeing a wonderful surprise. Mainly you hope it's going to be a chocolate one, obviously. Obviously. But you know, maybe it's one of those ones that splits in two and it's got a lovely message inside. Or every time you find an egg, you get a little kiss or something. Oh, cute. Yeah, what do you think? Yeah, it yeah, does sound like yeah. a lot of fun. It might take a bit of work to get going, but I think it's a lovely idea. Mm. Well, you need an incentive. If you know Know what your date really responds to so yeah. that can be the treat and the biggest treat obviously yes when you find the final egg for me it'll just be chocolate yeah <laughs> maybe some wine at the, wine end, at the end yeah That'll keep yeah. you going but whatever rocks your boat yes rocks your boat <laughs> i think the phrase is floats your boat <laughs> but if you want to rock the boat well, like, then... i don't want to just float it i want to rock yeah, that boat yeah good. number two picnic in the park yeah you could kind of pack a little picnic basket with your favorite treats a little blanket, maybe some Easter themed decorations. Mm -hmm. To make it a little bit special, I think is lovely. You could either go out at the right time to catch the sunset, maybe see all the beautiful colours, or if outdoors isn't really your thing, maybe a picnic in bed. Oh yeah, that would be fun, wouldn't it all snuggle down? Just be aware of those crumbs. I hate crumbs in the bed, don't you? <laughs> the next idea is to make the most of the beautiful season, which is of course springtime, and go for a romantic stroll together. Yeah, I think that's a lovely idea because all the spring bars will be out all the wildflowers and it is really lovely isn't it when you have a long winter and then all those lovely bright flowers come out and if you say in the UK there'll be a lovely stately home and you can walk around the grounds there and that's always really lovely too yeah definitely or perhaps if you're not really into walking you could do a, a cute bike ride mm. down some country lanes maybe get one of those tandems yeah I, I remember <laughs> back in the day hiring one of those tandems it was really fun really hard to do till you got used to it oh sure that would be fun and Anything that makes you kind of laugh. It's adventurous, isn't it? Yeah. Or oh, you could just put on some roller skates and go out together if you're really brave. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That could be cute too. I'd probably mm. prefer the bike. But yeah, yeah whatever, for sure. <laughs> whatever rocks your boat. <laughs> Easter spa night. Yeah, so maybe you could get some bath bombs, some scented candles, some rose petals. Maybe do a bit of like home massaging or take a bubble bath. Home massaging. Home massaging, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Play some of that spa music. Yeah, exactly. And you could perhaps buy some yellow candles. That's very Easter-like, yeah. isn't it? Yeah, and some appropriate coloured bath bombs yeah. and bubble bath. Get your chocolate back out. Yeah. Maybe you could just buy some daffodils and put it in a vase or a vase. Maybe you could get matching yellow robes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like two big Easter chips. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Our next idea is cooking an Easter dinner together. It's a good team effort, isn't it? It is, yeah. And of course, when you're finished, you've got that lovely meal to enjoy. Fun recipes that you could use that are Easter themed. You could always make a cake, for example, Easter cake. All the lovely decorations on it might be fun. A carrot cake. A carrot cake, indeed. <laughs> yeah. And then sort of decorate it with the little bunnies or chicks or a little yeah. egg. So what about an online class? They're fun too. And you could learn a new recipe and, and do that together and do it with other people in the group. And then you could get the candles back out from the spa. <laughs> day set them over the table and get the music back on you yeah, know and some nice table decorations nothing expensive you no. know just a few bright things to give it a real easter theme the next one is easter crafts yeah, not just for the kiddies. No, quite. You, know, you could paint some Easter eggs, maybe do some hearts to make it romantic. Mm -hmm. You could maybe make some decorations for your home. So every time you look at it, you think back about your lovely date night that you had together. Mm -hmm. Or maybe you can make a romantic Easter card for each other. If you are artistic, it would be lovely because you're embracing your artistic side. If you're not normally artistic, it's still going to be fun because you're going to have so many laughs like yeah. we did when we did some crafts way back in the day for Mother's Day. Or maybe you could learn how to do pottery and make a little Easter egg holder. Oh, cute! Yeah. Like in the, what's that movie where they oh, were the Unchained oh, Melody? Yeah. Um, oh, Ooh. is that in Ghost? Yeah. Is that in Ghost? Yeah. Yeah, because that's very, you know. It can be quite, you know. Sensual. Yeah. Yeah, see what, you know, your mind creates. <laughs> What about an Easter themed movie night? Oh, that sounds like fun. Get some popcorn, a big Coke. Yeah. <laughs> 
beach. <laughs> yeah, um, like you're in the, the cinema. Yeah, get some nice snuggly blankets or yeah. something and get your candles out again. That's always nice. <laughs> yeah, all yeah. of these ideas can involve yeah. candles. It doesn't have to be an Easter themed movie, any movie really. All I can think of is Easter Parade at the moment. Yeah, wasn't Chocola? Oh, Chocola, yeah, that's a lovely movie. I think it was, yeah. wasn't it? Well, I mean, either way, it's about chocolate. Yeah, so you can't go wrong there, can you no. really? The next idea is wine tasting. So you can head out to your local winery if you're fortunate enough to have one. Various restaurants offer this experience as well. You can just soak up the atmosphere together, try something new, compare notes, see mm. what you both think. If you don't drink alcohol, I think they do these events where you can do these mixology yeah. groups and you can make mocktails as well as cocktails. Yeah, it's just another way of kind of bonding together and mm. doing something that's maybe a little bit different. There are um, mocktails you can make, I believe, where you add like a marshmallow or one of the peeps to the mix. Oh, the American peeps. The peeps, yeah, yeah. yeah. We uh, tried peeps a couple of years ago for the first time. If you're interested in seeing our reaction, <laughs> then um, the link's in the description below. What about an Easter dessert date? Oh, that sounds like fun, I mean. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, you could have like afternoon tea and they're probably for Easter would have Easter themed cakes as well as your usual scones with clotted cream and jam. Yes, Yum. yes. Or go just to a bakery and mm -hmm. order some food to take away or to eat in. Get a nice cake to bring back, which is Easter themed, or get a plain cake and decorate it yeah. between the two of you. Why not visit a petting zoo? Get up all close with the little spring lambs and the chicks yeah. and all the other spring animals. Because you can actually sometimes pick the chicks up, cuddle the yeah. lambs or just stroke them. Yeah, and, uh, what a cute baby idea. Animals. And again, it's not just for kiddies, is it? No. I mean, who doesn't love baby animals? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Why not let us know if you've given any of these a try or if you have your own ideas that maybe we haven't thought of? Yeah, we'd love to hear them and it'd be good for other viewers to read the comments and see some more suggestions. If you've enjoyed this video, then please give us a like, maybe share with a friend and hit subscribe to follow us on YouTube.